It's a bit tricky to explain, but let's have a go. The Higgs boson was first proposed in 1964 by Peter Higgs as part of a theory that explains how some particles get mass. Physicists spent almost 50 years looking for it using huge particle accelerators until they built the biggest and most powerful of all, the Large Hadron Collider here at CERN, which finally cornered the Higgs in 2012. Cheers, Peter. All right, I'm getting to that. Now, imagine an invisible energy field that fills the entire universe, uh, represented by this rather small tray of mysterious black liquid. Ah, very good. Now, as a particle passes through the field, it interacts with it and gains mass, like this. Not bad, eh? The Higgs field is invisible, like air. The only way you know it's there is by making a sound or ripple in it. So, if we can create a ripple in the Higgs field, then we can prove it exists. And it's this ripple that shows up as a new particle, the legendary Higgs boson. Of course, you will need a 5 billion pound, 27 kilometer long super collider to find it. 